Good morning and welcome to WSRH News, your leading source for news at Seminar Ridge High. I'm Issa Fontecchio. And I'm Brooke McGrath. Today is Friday, February 10th. We've got a lot to tell you about this morning, but first, today's top story. Super Bowl is back. WSRH News reporter Dakota Parks takes us along to see who, who students is betting on, who students bet on winning Super Bowl this year. This weekend is the Super Bowl. We got Eagles versus Chiefs. So I'm going to go around asking people what their predictions are. First stop is the weight room. So what are your Super Bowl predictions? Chiefs all the way. Philadelphia Eagles. I got the Philly Eagles winning by a lot. Uh, I got the Filipino bird. Uh, I got the Chiefs. I got the New York Yankees. I got the Chiefs. Uh, I got Philly beating them boys. Up to building three next. I think the Chiefs are going to win. I'm just here for the halftime show, and so Rihanna's going to win. Um, I personally think the Chiefs are going to win. Go Hawks. Give me Kansas City Chiefs 31-27. I think that the Chiefs are going to win in Alliance side. I think the Chiefs are going to win too. I think it's going to be the Eagles. The Eagles. 37-0 to Eagles. 42-17 Eagles. What's wrong with y'all? Chiefs, of course. Come on now. I said she's going to win. I think the Eagles are going to win. 47 Eagles. Well, those were all great predictions, and my personal prediction is going to be the Chiefs. And for WSRH News, I'm Dakota Barks. Attention juniors and seniors. This year's prom theme is a night in Greece. Tickets go on sale March 25th. All students attending must have a 2.2 GPA or higher or an off-campus guest that is in high school or under 21. Prom contracts are outside of room 6101. Can't wait to see you there. There will be a first priority meet club meeting today in room 9103 from 3 to 4. First priority is open to anyone interested in fun, games, and learning about the Bible. There will be an equestrian club meeting today right after school in Miss Roker's room 6206. The meeting is open to anyone interested in horses. The Google Classroom code is 4DDUYH6. Interested in fashion? The Black Student Union will be hosting a fashion show they call Through the Ages on Friday, February 17th in the Seminole Ridge Auditorium at 6 p.m. Tickets will be $5. It is National School Counseling Week. National School Sc Counseling Week highlights the tremendous impact school counselors can have in helping students achieve school success and plan for a career. The theme of this year's National School Counseling Week is schools counselors help students dream big. Today's quote is, my students help me dream big by showing that through hard work and dedication, anything is possible. Miss Mancuso. Congratulations to this week's Hawks of the Week. Ninth grade, Alyssa Taylor nominated by Dr. Reed Thomas. 10th grade, Rashi Bryant, nominated by Coach Pollock. 11th grade, Devin Bullard, nominated by Miss Vento. 12th grade, Jada Graham, nominated by Miss Carbone. Students were nominated based on academic improvement or for their efforts in making our campus better by doing things like helping others, volunteering their time, or even simply picking up trash. Valentine's Day is next week. Do you know what you're doing for your special someone? WSRH News reporter Kyra Taub asked students for their ideas. Coming up very soon. I walked around campus today to ask a couple people about Valentine's Day. What are you doing for Valentine's Day? I don't even know yet. What are some good gift ideas? Uh, a necklace. A necklace with their name on it or your name on it. What is a great Valentine's Day date? Uh, probably a sunrise on the beach. Probably a sunrise on the beach. Some great gift ideas. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll say a teddy, teddy bear. bear. Yeah. A tea, a teddy bear. Flowers. Man, you gotta get that girl a car. What's a great place to take your date? Uh, the beach. The beach. Take her to um, Chick-fil-A. Her highs. A full for full. What are you doing for Valentine's Day? I'm going to try to hang out with my girl. What are some great gift ideas? Uh, chocolate. Uh, yeah, chocolate. What are you guys doing for Valentine's Day? I'm um, sleeping at my friend's house. Um, nothing. <laughs> what are some great gift ideas? Candy. A Bentley. <laughs> what is a great date idea? movies um like going to the beach and watching the sunrise coming up on wsrh news weather and birthdays plus sports do you ever sleep in class and get annoying bracelet marks on your face well buy a pillow pet you could sleep anywhere literally anywhere ever fail a test and get mad at your teacher well check it out then you can even play catch with a real friend <coughs> have you ever wanted your friends to shut up because you don't care at all well suffocate them with a pillow pet buy one now they're limited edition at www.pillowpet.com no one and nothing was harmed in the making of this commercial i think hey isa what flower gives the most kisses on valentine's day what flower brooke tulips 
Let's go to WS3 meteorologist Lainey Rodriguez with today's forecast. Good morning, Hawks. For today, we have a high of 83 and a low of 63, mostly sunny. On Saturday, we have a high of 85 and a low of 65 with showers. On Sunday, we have a high of 75 and a low of 56, sunny. And on Monday, we have a high of 71 and a low of 49, sunny. Well, that's it for WSRS News. I'm Lainey Rodriguez. We have a happy birthday going out to Austin Barndoller, Jeremiah Dukes, and Ella Altieri. Happy, happy birthday. birthday. WSRH sports anchor Adrian Murray joins us now at the sports desk. I wonder how our girls basketball team did last night. Good morning, Hawks. I'm Adrian Murray bringing you today's sports updates, so let's get right into it. Our girls varsity basketball team had a game last night versus South Broward. The girls took home another win, 42-26. WSRH News reporter Robert Biss has more on the game. It was definitely best you, right? I'm here with Jayla Midget, the starting point guard for the girls basketball team. So, Jayla, I heard you guys had your quarter district finals last night. Who'd you guys play against? Uh, we played against South Broward. Did you guys win? Yeah, we did. What was the score? It was 42 to 26. How many points did you score? I scored like eight points. Dude, that's wicked. Who are the other top performers? Um, Kiori, Naya, and Iasia. How'd you guys prepare for the game? Um, after our loss against Blanche Ely, it made us really want to win and be hungry for the win. So we just practiced our plays and we were prepared. Oh, that drives the key to a great team. So when do you guys play again? Uh, we play again on Tuesday. Who are you guys going to play against? Uh, we play against Blanche Ely at Pompano Beach. That's going to be a great game, guys. I'm Bobby Bessie, and this has been WSRH Sports. The girls' varsity soccer team is having an amazing season. They're undefeated with a record of 17 wins, two ties, and no losses. Tonight, their quest for a state championship continues with the regional semifinal battle with Dwyer High's Lady Panthers. The Lady Hawks beat the Panthers in overtime in the district championship game last week. But tonight, the ladies will have to do it again. Kickoff is at 7 p.m. Come out and support our Lady Hawks. The girls' varsity lacrosse team has their preseason tournament tomorrow. WSRA sports reporter Tyler Pites has more on the story. I'm here with Kendall and Reagan to talk about the girls' lacrosse team. So, when do you guys play? We play tomorrow at 9 o'clock. Who do you guys play? Dwyer and Palm Beach Central. How do you think you guys are going to do? Um, I think we'll do better than we did last year. What are your guys' strengths as a team? We have some really good shooters, a really strong uh, midfield, and our defense is really strong. Thank you for taking the time to talk with us. For WSRX News, I'm Tyler Take Price. a look at today's sports calendar. Girls Varsity Soccer Regional Finders versus Dwyer at home at 7 p.m. Wrestling at Jupiter High at 2 p.m. Track and field preseason meet at Jupiter High at 4 p.m. Good luck, Hawks. Well, that's it for WSRH Sports. I'm Adrian Murray. That's it for WSRH News. I'm Brooke McGrath. And I'm Issa Fontecchio. Remember that you can follow us on social media on Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube at Summer TV. Have a great day, Hawks.